Most people can multiply all the way up to the 12 times table and they learn how to do that in primary school. But what I'm going to show you right now is a trick on how you can extend this out. How you can extend your multiplication range so you'll be able to multiply any two numbers under 20 instantly in your head. So let's have a look at an example. 14 multiplied by 17. Now the way this trick works is pretty simple. We're going to look at the units digits of each number. So we have 14, we have a 4, and 17, the units digit is a 7. So the first step is we're going to add one of these numbers, so the 14 here, to the units digit of the other number. So 14 plus 7 equals 21. Now the next step is to multiply that 21 by 10. Pretty easy so far, so 210. What we do now is we multiply these two units digits. So 4 times 7 equals 28, and we add that on. So 210 plus 28, we have our final answer of 238. And there you have it, how to multiply any two numbers up to 20. Do you like that? Well, what about we have a look at another one? So in the next example, let's have a look at multiplying 12 by 14. Same rules apply. We're going to have a look at the units digits. So that is two and four. So first off, let's add 12 to four. 12 plus four is equal to 16 times 10 is 160. Now we multiply these two numbers here. Two times four is equal to eight. And we add that on, our answer is 168. That's pretty cool, right? Works for every number in its teens up to 20. So let's get serious now. What about three of these that you can try? So here we go. We're going to start with 16 multiplied by 18. Uh, we're going to then move on to 19 multiplied by 17. And then finally, we'll have 18 multiplied by 13. So why don't you pause the video and give these a go. And if you want to be really brave, before I go through the answers, put your answers in the comment and then check how you've gone. And while you're at it, hit the like button. So let's have a look at this. First off, we have 16 multiplied by 18. So the units are 6 and 8. So first off, we have 16 plus 8. 16 plus 8 is equal to 24. Uh, 24 times 10 is 240. And to that, we're going to add 6 times 8. 6, 8 to 48. So we pretty easily get our answer. 240 plus 48 equals 288. How did you go with that one? Let's have a look at the next one. We have 19 multiplied by 17 with the digits nine and seven in the units place. So 19 plus seven is equal to 26, which is gonna go up to 260 plus seven nines is 63. All right, so we have 260 plus 63. We can get our answer really easy, which is 323. All right, are you two for two? Have a look at the last one. So 18 multiplied by 13. 8 and 3 be our units digits. 18 plus 3 is equal to 21, so that's going to go up to 210, plus 3 eighths are 24. Okay, so you'll easily get your answer. 210 plus 24 is 234. Done, dusted, happy days. Did you get 3 for 3 on that? If you did, leave a reply to your own comment calling yourself a legend because that's really, really well done. What do you think of that trick? Pretty good? Well, there's going to be plenty more coming along. So stay tuned. I look forward to seeing you then.